Because you've how many done loads of interviews? No, but some of them are interesting and some of them are not. So, so how, did you, how did you get to Baku? Any Azerbaijan? <laughs> like how did you find the stage? Oh, it was there. <laughs> uh, Azerbaijan, yeah. That yeah. Sort of <laughs> <laughs> basically, basically. What do you think about Baku? I was like, <sighs> Baku. <laughs> Okay, Roy Bennett for 12points.tv here in Baku or Baku Baku <laughs> with the lovely Loren. It seems like only a couple of months ago we were in Sweden. Yeah. 700,000 votes. And the whole of the globe and going, we're going up, 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 up. <laughs> you know, I had my in airs on, so I didn't hear that. You guys heard it, but I didn't. What was it like, though? on the stage of the globe, just looking out and seeing all these people with their hands in the air and everything, or just, were you oblivious to that sort of... No, I, you know, I, I was so happy about it because I love it when people unite, you know? And when they have, when we have, we have so many things in common and that, that time, right there, we had one thing in common, we loved the song and we sang it together and it was, I was, I was very happy, although Perhaps you didn't, see, you didn't see that, but I was. <laughs> I think you were afterwards, yeah. yeah. Um, the staging is yeah. what everyone wants to know about. This. Sort of all the Eurovision fans want to know, will the staging be exactly the same? Will it be different to Sweden? There will be one huge difference, um, and that is the clothes. Yeah. I'm still having the same colors, green, because it, it, it gives a, a feeling of harmony. At least that's the whole point of it. Uh, so, so, but the clothes, yeah. Hope you like it. Now, will there be large shoes like these? No, no. This, this is me privately. Uh, no, not privately. Uh, either I'm, I'm, I'm like an extremist. Either it's really high heels or no shoes at all. Because on stage I don't wear any shoes. I'm barefoot. That's the point. That's probably good because on the stage I, I saw that you're on a, a slightly raised platform. Yeah. And you falling off into the crowd could be a bit dangerous. Isn't it kind of rock and rollish <laughs> to do that? But, could, I, but I'm not sure. What, maybe sort of like you could crowd surf to the back of the arena and back. <laughs> yeah, no. good idea. I'm going to tell that to the guys. <laughs> I'm going to tell that to the guys. See how they like that. So, so you, you've been to the viewing room <laughs> yeah, and you've seen everything. So I've seen you've seen everything. how it works. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. It looks good. Yeah, you know, I'm a creator. You know, creators, they're never happy or satisfied. And so there's always some things you want to change and, you know, Today was basically mostly about technique. Where's the cameras? Oh, there's a camera over there. Oh, and you know, and uh, how huge is the stage? And not so much heart, more technique. One of the lovely parts I think about the arena is the minute you start singing, particularly I had the, the sound check, the vocal check, and your voice sort of echoed all around, and we could even <laughs> hear it here in the press center. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, That's I love great. the arena. Uh, one of the things that Sweden has in common with Azerbaijan, Azerbaijan's song last year was written by Swedish composers. Yeah, it was written by Swedish and composers. Quite frequently the best composers come from Sweden. So, yeah. new album, Swedish composers, maybe? Um, yes, actually yes, and I'm one of them. <laughs> <laughs> so a lot of things in, in the album is going to be written by me together with with some yeah Swedish composers. I, I never I, thought I, about. I heard the name Clear Up mentioned. Yeah. Are we allowed to say that? Yeah, you're allowed to say that. Clear Up. Yeah, one song is with Clear Up, and he's really good, really, really good. And he's dark also. His productions are very dark and emotional. And he's he worked and with Robin. Yeah, he's worked with Robin, and he's worked with uh, uh, Atio is another artist. That's yeah, and they're always singles. Um, Hopefully, this one is a good one. <laughs> when can we expect the album to be? Fall, September. Fall. Oh, that's, very, that's very American fall. Yeah, this fall. <laughs> this fall, it was September, hopefully. That's great. Is there any possibility, just a little bit of your song? I know. Last Euphoria? Interview, yeah, just for the fans. Of course. Euphoria, forever till the end of time. From now on, only you and I. We going up, 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 up. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much Thank and good you. luck. Oh. <laughs>